Okay, one more flight with this one, and then I'm going to switch to the uh, little gold rush, and we can compare the height on the video. I'm launching, the camera is always at the same place, it's on my backpack, and uh, my launch spot is always the same spot, so you can make a direct comparison against the, the height. Oh, ho, ho. yeah, that's a nice launch into lift. And this airplane does ride the lift. Look at that. Oh, yeah. So some folks have said that the cruciform stab is a little bit more uh, prone to spinning in. Haven't noticed it with this, but it might be because I put the little flaperons on the stab. So. The flaperon, so my right stab tip is up and my left stab tip is down. And so that tends to get, create an adverse roll, rolling against the glide turn. So as the airplane speeds up, that rolling force kicks in and I guess, hopefully, maybe prevents it from spiraling out of the lift. But you can see now I'm like centered in the lift, nice tight turn and obviously going to have to DT from height. There we go, DT'd, and down she comes. I wonder if I can catch it. I have to say, overall, I like the action of the uh, broken back DT because the airplane comes down nice and stable. Caught it. Um, you know, the, uh, the tumbling pigeon forward popping wing that I'm using on Gold Rush, very effective. Uh, and may be necessary, like so, in a nice thermal like that, or a stronger thermal. If I use the broken back style DT on the Gold Rush, it might not. It might just keep going. You know, just sit there spinning happily in the in the lift, and up she'd go. And there's nothing you could do about it. Whereas with Tumbling Pigeon, the model is constantly it sort of side slips. I'm trying to show you here, side slips off the uh, the, di the polyhedral. And that, I think, prevents it from making any progress upwards in heavy lift. So, I think for the ultralight gliders, the uh, tumbling pigeon might be the way to go, even though you don't get that nice kind of loopy, safe type recovery when you, when you hit the emergency DT. Instead, you get a bunt. And if you're too low, you get a bunt into the ground. Anyway, thanks for watching. That was a good one. Next one I'm going to do is a little gold rush.